Hello guys and welcome to Timigate. Today I'm going to share with us a short video on how you can configure an interface on a MicroTik router as a DHCP client. The reason you want to do this is probably because you have an ISP that has DHCP server configured already. So you want your interface that is connecting to the ISP to just acquire an IP automatically. One of the things the DHCP server is going to give to you will be IP address as well as uh, as well as subnet mask, default gateway and DNS. You have that setup, it's very easy. So you click on uh, IP, you click on DHCP client and you click on the block sign here. Once you've done that, you choose an interface that you want to make a DHCP client with that. So you, you leave this uh, 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 provision here that says add default route. This will allow your own router to acquire default route automatically from the uh, service provider as well. So once you've done that, you just click on apply and open. The moment you do that, your router is going to search for and acquire an IP address automatically from the DHCP server. So to confirm this, you go to IP and you click on addresses. Once you click on addresses, you will see that this interface, Eta1 that we just configured now, has acquired an IP from the DHCP server. And the D here beside it shows that the IP address was acquired dynamically. All right. So you can also confirm that you actually acquired a default route also from the DHCP server by going to IP and coming to route. When you click on route, you should be able to see this default route here pointing to ETA1. This was acquired uh, also dynamically from the DHCP server. So guys, that's how quick and easy it is for you to set up your router as a DHCP client. Thanks for watching. You can also visit my blog at www.timigate.com. Timigate is spelled T-I-M-I-G-A-T-E. Okay, and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching and stay safe.